All right, folks, uh, this is actually a short video on looking at position sensor offset error in permanent magnet synchronous machines. And you can see that we have here a permanent magnet synchronous machine coupled to a DC machine. Uh, basically, it's a very simple dynamometer. Uh, and we have a dual inverter stage here driving these. And you can see at the end of the PMSM, there's a position sensor that we are using here. And I'm using D, uh, D space DS1104. And here you can see the interface I'm using. Uh, and the very important point to look at is the second graph uh, on the first figure, first set of figures, second figure. Uh, that's the torque that I'm measuring on the shaft. You can see here I have a torque sensor. Uh, and then we have the transducer then feeding the signal back to this space and uh, I'm regulating a speed of 200 RPM on the, uh, the DC motor. The PMSM is, uh, is working as a torque actuator and I'm commanding 1 amp Q-axis current and I'm injecting a position sensor offset error which is, uh, which is seen in the right uh, and the set of figures on the right, the bottom figure, right? So I'm gradually introducing uh, an offset error from 0 to 2 pi. It's a stepwise increase. And you can see that our torque here, it's uh, starting from 0, it's going into a peak value, and then it goes back to 0 and back to negative torque. Uh, not even, not back to, but it goes to negative torque as I introduce this position sensor offset error, meaning uh, if you have a significant amount of position sensor offset error, it'll, it'll be able to drive or cause your torque to go to uh, negative torque, or zero or negative torque. Uh, all right, and there's a very nice paper that's published in ECCE. You, uh, anyone interested can take a look at that. Please feel free to reach out to me if you have questions. Thank you.